take two of the uh, tie-in spade end hook length. Um, as I said in the previous video, light should be a bit better today anyway. I use three of these frenzy hook length boxes. I've got the, the light, the medium and a heavy one. So I'll just grab whichever box I need. They're already labelled up. Uh, the Stonfo hook tire. It's got all the measurements on there. You can extend the bar to make longer hook lengths if you need to. It's all magnetic so I just crap it onto my uh, freezer so they don't move. Hook's already in there. Just uh, tie your loop in your line. You can use a hook tie if you wish but I just find it a bit easier doing it this way. Uh, most of the hook boxes they're not exact. This one is. Uh, some of the older ones I used to have, I'm not mentioning any names, but they were uh, quite a way off with their measurements. This one is bang on. Just make sure that's straight. Scissors. Cut the excess line off. Stick it in your hook box. Job done. Saves a lot of faffing about trying to measure it out and whatever. I know there are different versions of this setup um, on the market. I just found this one a lot easier than any other one, but I do use the uh, the MIDI matchman hook tire as well. Depends what mood I'm in really I suppose. But, but if I'm sitting down doing a lot I'll just get this one out and do it that way. Makes my life a lot easier. If you've got any questions or anything just uh, give us a message below or whatever and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks very much. Tie lines.